Hi, uh, my name is Mary Jo Federley, and I'm a C45 quad, but I'm also just a gal <laughs> who had a spinal injury uh, nine years ago. Yoga has contributed in many levels to my healing and also to my ability to be um, accepting and comfortable about my situation. So it's helped me physically, um, it's helped me immensely, emotionally and psychologically. Most of you will say, I can't feel my navel. Well, I couldn't either, but I've got a lot of upper body and torso control now, even though I'm And it's helped me also um, uh, in a way that I, I probably couldn't have described nine years ago, but uh, to understand the, the nuances of, of being physical in a different body. When I was first injured, I had no arm movement except on my right arm. And initially they told me that that would probably be always the way, that I might be lucky to get my left arm back and that I would just you know, have to wait and see. And after the eight and a half months that I spent in GF Strong as a high level quad, a complete uh, Asia A4-5 quad, I, I never stopped doing, you know, visualizing in yoga through pranayama and, and other sort of um, ways throughout my time in the hospital and I just accepted what they said with a grain of salt <laughs> um, to be true for, for whatever they you know could see it as being true but for me I didn't want to hold that as my own truth as my total truth and I wanted to see what would happen so I didn't take any of the medications and I really wanted to explore well what does happen with paralysis and what is the body capable of and, and where do I go with this so for me, it's been a journey, and, and uh, I can't believe what I've gotten back, and hardly, you know, really can many other people, and most people kind of say, almost may say it, and yet, you know, I, I really know for my own experience anyway, that there's no magic going on here. There's just, you know, consistency. There's the um, willingness to, um, to listen and to be responsive to the system, and there's the tools that yoga offers. You don't really heal a spinal cord, you can't put it back together. And so it's kind of like having a raw nerve open, um, which needs you know, consistent um, amelioration and, and um, direction. Uh, it doesn't have its own way to understand, oh, okay, we'll relax now. So yoga is that tool. Um, and in addition, I, I would say just the psychological framework of understanding myself not just as a physical body, um, helps immensely with the emotional mental component. And then inhale. I do offer private uh, sessions which are usually a group of people that get together and, and come to my house and practice and I also do single privates at my studio and I'm working right now with um, a lot of the different organizations in the Lower Mainland to begin to teach some adaptive yoga out in the community. Good, let's try that one more time. Feels good? Yeah, inhale up. To see adaptive yoga tutorials and also to listen to me talk uh, more about yoga, um, go to the link below.